hello collective welcome back to my channel thank you guys so much for your likes your comments your shares and subscribes i truly appreciate them all let's tap in to get a message for you guys um let's see what you need to know what y'all need to be aware of for y'all weekend what's going on for the weekend reading for my collective weekend reading for the collective So Empress, I just seen the Empress, I just seen stuck, I just seen uh somebody doing too much, somebody <laughs> somebody could be really doing too much in the emp or Empress. It could be a divine feminine, somebody mother, a boss, a CEO, somebody wife, whoever. Somebody could be really abusing their power, okay, over the weekend. Could be uh an occultist, all right. Let's see, what's the message? energy or this is what they was trying to do okay to a divine feminine what's the overall energy i'm here and i'm still going so there's nothing somebody can do about something i don't know if somebody's trying to stop you from doing something collective but collective like i'm still doing it i'm still going you know, kind of energy. I don't know if somebody don't want you to move or don't want you to go somewhere. You're still going. New beginnings. Happy times. All right. So new beginnings and happy times. All right. Is ahead of somebody. Wow. We got the higher thing. Something to do with spirituality. Something somebody could uh, have a spiritually based business. Uh, somebody could work. With the occult energy, of course, somebody could do is really good at manifestations and stuff like that. All right, yeah, and somebody's manifesting happy times ahead. Okay, somebody's manifesting good news. Um, this is something someone wanted, patience was needed because somebody was doing too much, but now somebody's awakened to going within here about a divine of a uh. Ooh. What the hell? A divine masculine is having a rebirth. Somebody know they did too much, like by doing too much. Somebody was made a lot of mistakes because they did a lot. Okay, and it's like something got exposed. Okay, somebody, I see you. So there could have been um, people that was not expecting you to figure something out, collective, or see them in your energy. You know trying to dictate what you do when you do it how you do it okay and somebody's at the point where like i'm still doing it they're in that energy hmm. and that's good let's see they were somebody was trying to steal something from a mature woman it could have been a capricorn or something around capricorn season right a privileged lady, somebody was trying to steal something. Could have been, even been a privileged lady that was trying to steal something. Shit. You just never know sometimes. <laughs> but let's see. Baby crows. Okay. Something about baby crows. Um... So, I have bird feeders, okay? And all of the sparrows, you know, really be, you know, going at the uh, bird feed or whatever. But the bird feeders really, you know. But I also notice when baby crows come around, everybody else get gone, okay? It's a lot of new life right now. You know, it's the beginning of the spring. Um... All of the rest of the birds get going. So, 
there's some ravens, okay? Baby ravens and baby crows. That's crazy. But <laughs> that's what I'm hearing. So with this new energy and sparrows, uh, a whole bunch of them, you know, that's gossip. Somebody talking, you know, heavy crap. But nevertheless, I got bird feeders. They eat, they be eating and shit. But somebody is like something, something, something about gossip. There's some sort of dispersing of the gossip because... Somebody could be afraid of something, right? Or there's bigger prey on their ass. So say somebody was gossiping about y'all or something like that. People are starting to look at the people that are gossiping. That's what I'm hearing, okay? So that could resonate with several of y'all because, you know, clearly people be talking hella crap about people that are spiritual. So we got the world card. Happy times coming. New beginnings. And somebody is concerned. Yeah. A thief is concerned because something is changing. A mature woman could be concerned. All right. Because something changed. They were not expecting this change. This is somebody that could be heavy into the occult. Right. How did you know it was them? Somebody don't understand how you figured them out. How did you pinpoint where something was coming from right something is changing now wow lovers and coughing something is coming to an end of somebody uh being held in high honor in the community somebody courtship maybe people were working together to get unexpected income but somebody feel like they made a uh, Mistake, a uh, immature mistake. Okay, something wasn't thought out. So whatever that is, somebody felt like they didn't plan correctly, or <sighs> yeah. Hmm. Spirit, divine spirit. Where is the message? Where is the message? Kindred and communication. So a friend of a friend of a family member, a friend of something. Okay, they could be communicating to somebody right now. They could be telling somebody something. Maybe something they found out. Yeah, that you could survive something or something is going to. Uh, move forward for you because you made the right decision at the right time. <sighs> yeah. Somebody do a lot of things on a laptop. I'm seeing them. Yeah. And it's like, it is what it is. As it is, you're, you survive something. So they can't change something because you survive something. Somebody too gangster for their own good. It's a female. What's this message here? Holy Spirit, Divine Spirit. Somebody definitely don't act they age. Somebody could be older, but they be acting like, you know, they they younger. Right? What's all over? What's going on here, ancestors? They could be like older, older though, like older, older. Let's see. Absence. Okay, so somebody absent service, play and service. So somebody wasn't there, like somebody could be absent right now, or they didn't show up. You just somebody did not show up to do something or to help somebody do something. Somebody ghosted somebody, or somebody is not there. What else? Absent. Give me three more cards, please. I did. I said that somebody do this a lot. Okay. They could really be into the Ouija board and they know you survived something. This person that was doing the work know you're going to survive. And we got a self-fulfilled prophecy here. It's happening now and they could be praying. Yeah, because you defended yourself or something like that. 
from somebody playing in your energy. A friend know that you remember something now or you know something about being in someone's house. Hospitality and home. They could have promised a wise guy here and now a spiritual throne of the innocent if they cause conflict. But there was some conflict to a driver. They didn't. They thought they was their objective was hidden or what they was planning to do. The person that was driving the situation or the person that was working on somebody's crown. Somebody could. They can't get in right now. Somebody could uh, uh, block somebody. Somebody feels like by you catching them, they everything is going to backfire on them. Somebody is nervous. They could be talking to a high priestess right now about this. Somebody that, uh, like, what can they do now? Because you know it's them. Something like that. I don't know how you how they feel like you caught them. But somebody felt like you caught them in your energy or something like that. Hmm. But somebody ain't there. It's like somebody knows that you, something. They could even got a reading done. Also, they can't detect the magic or something like that that somebody was doing or something is non-detectable. Somebody can't detect something like they can't pick something up. And that's how they know consciously that you survive. You're going to survive something. All right. False twin, somebody that is weird, twisted, and strange individual. They don't have to be anything to do with like you being a twin flame. This could be just a random person that don't have a twin, okay? Like somebody here that's here to learn lessons and stuff like that. Like everybody don't have a twin flame, we know that. But this is like somebody that want to have a twin flame, but they don't. This person always play a lot of games. They always partying. This person could be, I just heard a widow or divorced, married in reverse. This accents. Yep. So this could be family members, friends, ex lover, meddling family members or friends. Yeah. They they woke. Being aware, you know, like I said, somebody's trying to get out of my like, energy because they know you know it was them. I'm hearing it was obvious though. So it's like, say this is like a, you always knew it was your mama's side of the family kind of energy. <laughs> Something like that, okay? Maybe because you never dealt with your daddy side of the family. So it had to be. It was it was like kind of like duh energy, right? Somebody like, damn. Now this person that like to take shortcuts, they gonna have money problems. Whoever this is is a spiritual hater. Was hating on your non-traditional beliefs. Maybe they were very spiritual, not spiritual, religious, okay? Whatever their religion is. So absence, third party here. They want to copy your style, okay? There's somebody that could try to be like you or whatever, act like you so much. Amucha. Third party situation, copying your style. What else? Wow. Somebody got feel betrayed now. Backstab disloyal. Doing you wrong, betraying your trust. This person could have did that for clout. Clout chasing. They stress now because your light keep your light is irritating a demons. Yeah, whoever this person is that's divorced or broken up with somebody or whatever, say they even married still, but they just not with a person. They are in regret right now. Aw, beautiful. They're in regret right now. 
because they feel like they sabotage themselves. It's crazy because whatever magic um, they was doing to you or something like that, they definitely feel like it's going to come back to them because you caught them. All right. That's the only reason why somebody feel like that. Like they felt like they was like under the radar that you would never know who was the third party that was, you know, trying to copy your style or do some weird shit. They feel like, yeah, backstab. They in regret. Someone is in regret for what they did to you, how they treated you and how they contribute to the mess. Wow. Somebody can have a bad contract or they signed some bad contract here. Yeah. And ain't no lies. This is truth. No lies are being spread right now. This is facts. Somebody sabotaged themselves. They could be having legal issues right now. Oh, man. They signed some bad deals. nosy but they don't have any they can't find no information so somebody signed a bad contract and they couldn't blame something on you or they couldn't get no information from you or what oh yeah all up in your business projecting pointing out things that but it was really them that was doing it this person is in a mental prison. Someone is feeling trapped in their head, maybe suffering from mental illness and self-limited beliefs. This person, they losing their damn mind. They feel trapped because they can't find out any information on you. They can't find something out that they need to solidify something. So this deal is all is off, some sort of contract is over or whatever. Yeah, and they're jealous. This is somebody that's very jealous of you wanting what you had. Wow, divorced. So this person could be divorced that's jealous of you. Want what you had. They wanted what you had. But somebody lost the connection when it came to this magic that they was doing. Like I said, somebody don't can't find another way to get a line on you spiritually. Okay. So they lost the connection and the truth is being revealed. Somebody has evidence of what this person do. One social life here, a distorted feminine here. Divine union, maybe something to do with your uh, sacred union. Somebody wanted to be more than friends, but somebody seeing this person, it's crazy. Deranged, okay? They felt like you didn't deserve something. They should have it. What kind of energy? So consciousness. Yeah, they know they sabotage themselves. Yep. Look at this. People are walking away or somebody's walking away. So consciousness, they know they are sabotaged. Something is like the plan is foiled. The, everything is sabotaged. It's, it's, it's over. For real, for real now. Like for real. All right, whoever these meddling friends, family members, ex-lover, whoever this is. Hmm. Someone has been caught doing something that they shouldn't. They know you caught them. And now they're in regret. Wow. Distorted masculine. Somebody is walking away because they have having money problems. Wow. Ex-lover. It's salty and mad. And they confident, somebody's confident that you, you're you very generous or they know you're very generous. You could have been very generous to this person that's in a mental prison, this narcissist, because maybe they're a narcissist. When it comes to your accolades, they they wanted to be fake friends. So now we got survival. So you survived something. They know you survived something. Survival. Role model. No, oh, damn. Being inspirational to others and having a positive 
outlook from a lot of people. And this really got them in the mental prison. That you're really a role model. And people really fuck with you. Like genuinely fuck with you. Like somebody could have tried to start talking trash. And instantly. Like you know how you're no longer the butt of the jokes. Okay. <laughs> Something like that. You're no longer the butt of the joke. So before you could have been like the butt of the jokes. Everybody you know now somebody tried to talk shit about you. People side eyeing somebody. Anybody. You don't even got to know these people, okay? So, they're the butt of the joke because they're like, how you going to talk shit about a role model? What, what have you accomplished this this lifetime? Hmm? <laughs> like, somebody start asking questions like that. And people start getting offended. It's like, well, what did you accomplish? Oh, really? Nothing? Oh, okay. Oh, you still stuck in the same position? Oh, all right. You still on your... You still in... Um... In the reverse, as a masculine or a female, a feminine energy, you still insecure, you still jealous. Oh, wow. Like, you really haven't grown this lifetime. Somebody like, Shh. they can't talk shit about you. So it's like, they rather, and now, damn, somebody gonna be smart and be like, oh, you seen so-and-so? Yeah, like, so this is what they're gonna be hearing and they like, oh, they don't wanna hear it. Um, yeah, so-and-so doing this. You heard so-and-so, this and that, and the third. So-and-so got this going on. So-and-so got this, 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 that. Like, shit like that. Right? Somebody is like, they don't want to hear that. But that's what's happening. They don't want to hear how good you're doing, how how uh, magnetic you are, how much you're a role model, like how people look up to you. Okay. Yeah, and how generous you are. You can be very generous. This role model is very generous. So you're not stingy, okay? If you got it, everybody got it, no matter what. You know? You paying the, the bill for the person behind you in line. Like, you that kind of person. And that's, the, that's how you're supposed to be. I don't know what happened to the world, but in all actuality, that's what we, we're here to help each other. We're here to lift each other up. Not tear each other down, but whatever, though. That's just... Me and a couple other people that believe that, <laughs> okay? Like, we don't look at things like that. Like, how everybody else is like, shit, I got to, you know, with your hands clenched tight, how you going to get anything? Being generous, giving to others, that's how, you know, you actually accumulate the things that you want in life. But not just because you want, you know, you want to take the picture with them. Like, look, I'm handing this stack of money to so-and-so. Look, say cheese for the Instagram. No, do types of shit like that on a sh don't tell nobody and see how your life improve and see how whoever come up against you they can't knock you down because they have no idea how you are off camera they don't have no information okay all they know is they just see you keep growing they don't understand you know those that, you know, oh, I'm I'm going to donate uh, such and such and such and I'm going to hold up the big check and I'm going to take the picture and I'm helping all the little kids. Them the ones, yeah, you might want to look out for. Because sometimes it don't even be for the kids. It be for their own. Oh, that, look at, he's such a good person. Oh, look at her. Look at they, they gave, look what they did for them children. Oh, they so nice. That's what they wanted for. But people like... Whoever this role model is that's generous, okay, you have no idea, okay, how much this person helps the world from the animals, okay, on up. But God sees it, so, uh, right? That's the kind of energy it is. You could have been generous to people that was even... You know, talking shit about you at one point. That's okay. Because your intentions was pure. Who gives a shit what their intentions was? That's their own burden to bear. Not yours. So as as they think they getting away with something or as they think that ha 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 you being you da 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 da. Ha ha ha. Joke's on you. Because where's your humility? Okay. <laughs> like somebody it, 
man, I feel like this Mercury retrograde, y'all, is is shaking things up. Okay, a lot of you guys um that are in the upright and you moving forward. Okay, um, people that was in y'all life that was not supposed to be there, they're being caught now, like that. Like to solidify the complete eclipse of them out your life or your energy. All right. This is wild. This shift here is this is about to be like on a whole nother level. Okay. It's either in fine tune tune um fine tunement. Something is going on. Something something is being rebalanced in the ethers. For a lot of us. Okay. So somebody knows. A role model is very generous. However the role model is. Yeah. Somebody could have been very generous. To somebody that was playing games. Okay. Always partying. Now this person is in a mental. Uh, prison. A narcissist. Yep. This person always needs attention. All right. A hater wanted to knock you down the side. So, like I said, even if they thought they was finessing you, they wasn't. Being a genuine person and being polite is a thing. It's a lifestyle, not just a, oh, for the right now, energy. Right? No. Oh, man. And somebody right now, I feel like, is choosing peace. No longer willing to... They don't care. Looking over your shoulder, all that. Somebody doesn't care anymore. Somebody knows that. Yeah. Because <laughs> this is a miracle. We got uh, collisions of attitudes, styles, energies, and belief. When somebody don't care, like whatever, you have to foster the energy of fear first before somebody can project it. So if somebody can project fear or negative energy towards you all day, but if you like, have a nonchalant attitude towards whatever they doing, they look stupid. You know, because it'll only affect their world. They're the ones that get angry. They're the ones that'll get, you know, bent out of shape while you just are relaxing. Having inner peace is a thing. Yeah, you need some space in this relationship. In this friendship, family shit, whatever. Beauty and the Beast, like I said. There's some sort of altumment on the foundation. Something is being rebalanced, okay? And they can't find a pinhole to get through. So they only had a pinhole to begin with, okay? <laughs> Somebody only had a little, you know, side door to get into your energy. Now that shit done got closed up. They like, oh my gosh. Now what? This person gonna just live a life of happiness? Yeah. Pretty much. Yeah. Whatever this was, is like something has been rebalanced when you released your power. It's like somebody tried to do it again and it just keep being rebalanced. So now somebody is going to keep, they're going to try to do something again or they did already. All right. And it got rebalanced. They tried it again, got rebalanced. Yeah. Whoever this is. Yeah. You need some space in this region. Like beauty and the beast. Like somebody's weird. They trying to burst back into your life. It's getting rebalanced. I'm hearing I wouldn't do that if I was you. So if this person trying to get into your life right now, they wouldn't, I wouldn't, they wouldn't suggest it. But whatever. They're gonna do what they want. But the karma that they get is the karma that they get. So don't be crying. When that shit hits you like a ton of bricks, you know? And if this is like a daredevil energy, say less. Everybody got to learn their lessons. It doesn't matter who you think you are. It's who you really are. At the end of the day, you can have any kind of persona you want. 
But when that shit start hitting in a certain kind of way, it's going to break you down to brass tacks. Your knees going to buckle. And that's the energy somebody is in right now. Okay? Because you are an individual. It's cleanup time. So you rediscovered your individuality by doing something. So now you're not connected to some sort of toxicity, some sort of devil energy, or somebody that's just something that's old and outdated. Like, it's off. It's like, get off me energy. Like, some fungi energy. Like, <laughs> oh no. This has got molded fairy, y'all. Like, it's some fungi energy that has been released from your life. Yep. So what goes around comes around. It's like cord cutting. Um, for some of y'all, this could have been like a cord cutting situation, but I'm not getting that. This feels more so spiritually. Like you didn't do anything to besides make a certain move here, but you didn't do any work to get this energy off you something's just, it's like, it's so old, it decayed. Something is decaying. And it's like, from the, your will, your strength, it's like an old rubber band, right? You know what happens to an old rubber band collective? Uh, it turns brittle and it'll break down. So say an old rubber band was tied around something for a long time. The rubber band, this is the connection that it 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 got dried out, dry rotted, okay? And the stronger you got, you were able to pop the chains from that old rubber band energy. And you are moving forward triumphantly. So everything is all over the place for somebody. What goes around comes around. This is very much so dark people. An elder will teach you. This is something that they mama or grandmama taught them on how to invade people's space here. But you seeing clearly here, you seen who was doing what, right? Like I said, this could be family members. This could be ex-friends or whatever. They know you know what they did. And they no longer have a connection to you. All right? Because it's, it's something that's old and outdated. But what goes around comes around. Let's see. This is also how somebody was able to uh, siphon a little bit of your energy. It wasn't a lot, but it was enough for them to feel young again or feel um, something like some sort of youthful rejuvenation or something. That's the message. Yep, look at that. But now somebody's been casted away. Feeling abandoned out in the depths. This person has been casted out of your energy. And now it's a common of the chaos. This person has a lot of chaos. Sure. You are unlike anyone else. Sweet memories. It's magical cleaning space. So now somebody, they, mm, strange companions in stranger places, challenges, use your, something is too challenging to use their imagination because you cleared some sort of em energy out. Also sweet memories, you know, those nostalgic memories about how in the past, you know, when you was littler and you be at the family cookout or something like that. That's how somebody was able to stay connected in some way, shape, or form. Like a parasite. Like somebody was a fucking parasite. That's just what I'm getting. Okay. Um, this person was able to stay connected like on some parasite shit. Like you don't even know that they there, but they there. Like, um, and how they was doing it was by uh, having some sort of like memory of like, oh, I, I didn't, why would I like to count them out of if this person would do you something or not, right? Oh, well, I was the only, 
Like I was your favorite cousin or I was your uh, best friend for like how many years? Why would all of a sudden I do such and such and such? Or I was, I was da 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 but something clicked to whoever you are, you're a wing seer. You started seeing something clearly like what something really was about and where something was coming from. So you could have just cut this person off like I'm cool and that dismantled everything that somebody had going on. All right. I feel like this is like I said, either a group of people or a toxic family dynamic and a lot of y'all's life here. Mm -hmm. So somebody's lies that's coming to an end. Somebody been lying on you or doing weird stuff in y'all energy that's coming to an end. Somebody being stubborn. They mad as hell that something is coming to an end in your life and you are getting some sort of celebration. All right. Holy Spirit, Divine Spirit, what is the message? Hmm. to blackmail you to get an upgrade that ain't working out so well for them now holy spirit divine spirit what is the message holy spirit divine spirit yeah you about to level up the information might be leaving somebody shook that you took a moment to reflect to find out who was high in something yeah they was missing a major piece of the puzzle though you could have left the past behind completely or they had an opportunity to leave something behind completely around New Year's. But they could have seen some sort of angel numbers or something like that. Or you could be in angel numbers. You know, you'd be able to celebrate. Somebody could be getting arrested. Somebody was trying to hide from somebody or something. Now they, you, But you took a moment to reflect and they shocked right now that you knew something. Yeah, who was causing imbalances in your life, which is corny as hell. Like, whoever this is, they corny for that. Yeah, this person definitely was doing a lot of mirror work, or this person was trying to marry your energy. Somebody was being extremely childish in your energy. That's coming to a complete end. All right. Child. People were just doing stuff. Being rude. Yeah, somebody is very much so pissed. They are pissed off. They could have been hoping for some sort of something to happen to pop off. Damn. Hmm. Yeah, they really was hoping that they would gain full control over something. They was praying that this robbery go through. Somebody was praying for a lot of shit. They realized that it was only a fantasy, like. That shit, wow. Leveling up. Your life is leveling up. What's your life leveling up? Your life is leveling up. Somebody shocked you took a moment to reflect to find out something. <laughs> yeah, perseverance. You definitely went through the move through the challenges. Yeah. Your life is leveling up. Perseverance. Because you persevered through something. Whatever idea that you had was the right idea. Now somebody can't be arrogant. Or whoever this is that was being stubborn here. They feel confined in something. And they're worried. Because you persevere. Your life leveling up because you persevered through something. Wow, we got 777. Seven, seven. Okay. But in their in their um situation, is something is going backwards for them. Oh man, somebody is now worried. Okay, they can't be. They're not being stubborn no more. They're more so worried that you persevered through something, and your life is leveling up. Like and also they can't they they can't be stubborn anymore. Somebody could have thought. That it was a good idea here to invest in 
bribing people or tempting somebody or something was only a temptation. They feel awkward now. Stubbornness in the reverse. They can't be stubborn no more. Third, look. They can't be your enemy no more. They can't fulfill something here. That shit, wow. Third wheel enemy in the reverse. This person is not a part of your energy no more. They was planning to travel, but shit, they quit now. They got to quit bullying you because somebody could be sick. Or have some feel weak here because you loved yourself and you about to get these blessings or something like that. So they're shocked right now. Merit making in a reverse. The information is leaving them shook here because you survived some natural disaster. So they're not going to get merit for something. Shock. Shook here. They shook right now. Confirmation. Merit making in a reverse. They can't do something no more. What's the merit making in the reverse? Wow, this person is sick about this. They're enlightened that you are independent and free and somebody could be arguing with somebody now. Because they like, how the hell did you wiggle off of their line energy? <laughs> oh no, but that's the energy I'm picking up. Like, how did you get away? So somebody is sick about them not being able to get this merit or whatever off your back. What else? Wow. They see in, in the future or something. Somebody could have got a vision or whatever this is. Somebody know that they're going to have to think logically now about a home because somebody could have lied about something. And it ain't going the way they thought. Or they could have lied so somebody could rob you. That's another thing. Wow. Uh, Self-reflection. Take a moment to reflect. Take a moment to reflect. Take a moment to reflect. Oh. about what somebody desires was. Take a moment to reflect. This person is a, is afraid now. Maybe somebody taking a moment to, because they just, I guess somebody took a moment to reflect and found out, you know, somebody wanted to dominate somebody. Somebody could be depressed here because they really thought they had control over your mind, some sort of memory, something like that. But something got rejected. Or you was awakened about what to somebody religion here or what somebody was doing. I don't know. Whoever this religious person is. Or you was awakened to something. Or somebody got rejected for a donation. Or because somebody's desires was for somebody to be afraid. 2015 could be significant. Somebody could have been, what? Hmm. A collaboration. So somebody could be rejecting, collaborating with somebody. This is making them paranoid. Because somebody took a moment to reflect to see that they their desires was to keep somebody afraid. That's why something didn't work. Karma started playing out. Because somebody hid their true selves. Promise, yeah. Because somebody could have promised to curse somebody with misfortune, but that was a big risk here. You survived. Hi, they true selves. Somebody, whatever somebody promised, they are worried. Because they did promote something. When he when somebody could even travel to do something y'all overseas. <sighs> Child. And they lost. They worried they lost their savings.
somebody supporters, somebody is, that supported them, they could be surprised that somebody is separating themselves from someone. And they got to accept the fact that a soulmate or a soulmate here, if something came to an end of them getting victory and success, they didn't want to have to compromise in the situation. But somebody's afraid that they lost now. They worry. Because they promised that you wouldn't see them. Back to their hidden truths or you wouldn't find something out. But you did. they like, how did you find this out? Like, how did you know it was them? Maybe because you would have never thought, like, why would it be that person? Or why would it be that, you know, whatever. <laughs> you like, why would why would you even think, like, of them? But you did. So you could have left no stone unturned, this energy. You checked everything out. Somebody lost a lot. Somebody's no longer willing to be somebody's en enemy. <sighs> Excuse me, guys. Wow. Somebody could have tried to hack somebody's shit. A hacker could be involved. They thought they was going to get victory and success in this situation, but they didn't. Yeah. A queen of cups. You could be a queen of cups here that's getting some sort of recognition, okay? Public recognition or something like that. Somebody knows you got your strength back or you're very strong-minded. So somebody got to make a practical decision or you make good decisions in life. All right, wherever you are, maybe you made the right decision to be single and focus on your uh, growth spiritually, mentally, emotionally, whatever, right? Whatever that is to you guys. Let's see. What's coming towards y'all? Because somebody wanted to get you caught up. But it didn't work. So something is backfiring. What's coming towards y'all? Yeah. Okay. Wow. What's coming towards y'all? Yeah, okay. So he came out. A king of wands, Leo, Aries, or a Sag could be significant. All right, come in. So, also what I'm getting with this, and because of the picture, this is somebody that created something. It could be a creator. They could be a book writer. They could write books. Okay. Um, and how the story ended and how the story begins. So a part of someone's story, you could have been a part of a book of somebody's or you are a major part of their story. Some sort of story that they tried to create. Okay. About you or something like that. Somebody could be a writer, like I said. Um, but I feel like because he, in the movies or in the um, show, Supernatural, he was the one that wrote the books about, he was the down, he was the prophet that was getting the downloads about Dean and uh, Sam Winchester, okay? And he wrote books about their actual life, how something was actually playing out for them. But, and he later on became God energy, okay? Um, but bad in, in a darkest way. Because he wanted to dictate how somebody's life was going to go. So there's like somebody that tried to be God in your life, okay? 
Hmm. Temperance. Bring in balance to something that was imbalanced in some sort of group or society. Something is being balanced out here. All right. Queen of Wands. Somebody's confident that they're going to be able to. This could have been somebody that was overly confident that they was able they'll be able to cause an ending to you in the past but somebody could be making a decision about a queen of swords to partner up with someone but somebody wouldn't give up causing an illusion maybe about some text messages emails until they found out uh something about someone's mother and they are in regret for choosing to cause a heavy burden or something. So this could even be a reconciliation of the king and queen of wands. But I just feel like balance and harmony is being restored after some sort of action. That Because the queen of wands could be like a, a witchy kind of energy as well. Somebody is very good manifester. But they was confident that they'll be able to manifest something. What's their obstacle right now? The will of fortune is a faded event here for somebody to be released. Angels are winning here because they caused some sort of stag. They caught the devil. Wow. And they heartbroken that they're going to be in poverty and they can't get out. While you have this four of wands. So because Castiel is an angel. And he, he captured the devil energy. And this person is heartbroken. That they can't get out of the cold now. What's the outcome? So whatever karmic energy was in your life got caught by an angel. A hidden helper, somebody that's here to help you, like Archangel Michael and stuff. <clears throat> What's the outcome? Hmm, the star. Oh, this is like Earth Angel energy because he was both his mother huh yeah also I was getting like an equal blending of that dark energy and light energy that's being restored okay on this planet if there was something going on something that's being healed rebalanced restored renewed A lot of fiery energy, a lot of wands going back and forth. So, there be a lot of communication going on online or text messages, emails, or something like that going back and forth about something. Who the king of wands? This could have been the person that created something. Who the king of wands? The world card. Wow. In the page of wines. So this is a message that's going to maybe be a, ooh, shit. Maybe a message is going around that a cycle is over. A king of swords could be afraid now that the karma is about to play out. 
they could have offered a friend of the Queen of Swords to talk to you about some partnerships with the Queen of Cups. Ten of Cups, Ten of Pentacles. Somebody's ghosting the plan now because something is like trickster energy. Something is being rebalanced or something is, is not what it seemed. So somebody is realizing something was not what it seemed from the rip. They're looking at it. Right? Somebody's really looking at something. Like something was not what it what they thought it was. So somebody know that whatever is something is over with the world. They getting a message that cycle is over completely. The world here. Yeah, something about I'm telling you. <laughs> I'm telling you, I don't know how this 5555, five, 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 that's what it just said. I don't know how this is about to play out here, but there, there was a tower here to somebody's control over something. So a king of wands know that a cycle is over, eight of wands. Somebody is pissed off. They could be arguing with somebody because something backfired. The devil made me do it. All right. Eight of Wands. Somebody could be saying something that's very foul. They're very upset. Now that a cycle is over, they say the devil made me do it. Knight of Swords. Somebody is very upset. They could be very impulsive. They could be very angry. Because <sighs> something is backfiring on them. Somebody's shocked or surprised you're going to get victory and success here. This King of Pentacles could have lied just to cause a delay. So somebody could miss an opportunity to have a relationship. Four of Wands, Ace of Cups. Yeah. But now somebody all in their head because it's like, uh, hey, something is being shined on a mother figure. An older woman, an empress energy. The light is being shined on this person. All right. That was sitting on whatever kind of throne they was sitting on that they was really trying to win at all costs. They really tried to sabotage somebody and they are in regret right now because somebody got the message here of something that you knew the truth. Who was causing you heavy burdens or something? All right. What's temperance? Now something is being balanced out. Temperance. It's like, I'll take that. So if they, somebody was had something of yours, all right, something that belonged to you, somebody is being given back to you, you take something back. Something is being taken back. That's yours, though. And something was sealed up. What's the temperance? Five of Pentacles. Man. <sighs> Things are being balanced out. And somebody's in poverty now. And they is confused. How the fuck did you find this out? How did you know it was your family? Or how did you know it was a group? The, who the group of people was? Because somebody got more information. You could have found out that it was somebody in your family. Somebody you had a family with. Or something like that. They confused. How? How did you find out this information? Because they hid something like spiritually. But somebody, you could be happy that you found this out. Page of Swords is you knew you found out more information than you was like. So it's like unbeknownst to them. Just imagine them all together doing something. And you behind the scenes closing doors and locking them, closing doors and locking them, closing doors and locking it. So by the time they all get together, everybody is locked out now. Everybody. And they like, oh my fucking gosh. How did you know? How did you find out this information? That's what I'm hearing. Six of Wands. How did you find out this information online? They swore that somebody was going to get victory and success. Somebody confused how you found this out, Page of Swords. <sighs> yeah, because you took a leap of faith to defend yourself. So it's like, so you may have not known, maybe you didn't have sex, like, 
I know exactly X, Y, and Z, but you took some sort of precautions to defend yourself anyway, protecting your energy by all costs. Despite if you felt it in your gut or you had a hunch about something collective. And that's everything is changing now because they've been casted out in the depths of the damn, you know, water. Let's see. Feeling the band, it was the will of fortune. Their obstacle is something changed. Luck is on your side. What's the will of fortune? So this was a faded event though as well. Oh. The fool card and the four of pentacles. So something changed with somebody's control here. Like I said, somebody could have took this leap of faith here or you did to hold back from taking some sort of action towards someone. What's the four of pentacles? Or somebody swore they was in control of something. This is like a matriarch or older person. Like I said, mother figure, older, older somebody, auntie, somebody. Or they not related to you at all, but they are older than you. What's this four of pentacles? You held back from taking this leap of faith. That's why something went in your favor. Queen of King of Cups and the Queen of Pentacles. Trying to block a relationship. A relation. Wow. They tried to they're trying to defend themselves now to a higher fence because they did keep a secret from an emperor about a king of pentacles. Trying to get away with causing a delay and having them at a stalemate. So this King of Cups here could be having to put the brakes on taking the leap of faith to do something. Because something has changed now. The Star card. Because somebody like, how the fuck did you find out something? How did this backfire? They are pissed. Star card in the Seven of Pentacles. Somebody is now wishing that they would have invested or whatever they invested in. They reaping what they sow or they wishing that they would have took this leap of faith. This person could be a part of an organization of some sort. Seven of Pentacles, Two of Cups. They would have invested in a Two of Cups. They wish they would have partnered up with someone here. But this Queen of Cups here. Oh, man. So somebody could have tried to manifest or do this magic for this family. I don't... It's a lot of people. We got a Queen of Cups. Uh, Queen of Pentacles. That was trying to do workings for this family. Or they was doing the magic for someone. But you known. You knew something. Maybe they wished that they would have invested and partnered up with you instead. Take it as it resonates. But somebody, something came to their attention of who was blocking them. Take it as it resonates. Everybody, I don't. It was several people involved in this. Who the two of cups? One card for the two of cups. It's long-term investment with a partnership or a soulmate. A queen of pentacles. Somebody that's in the upright, that's very responsible. All right. They could be making, they could be getting something here. Uh, some sort of offer because they made a practical decision here. So whatever actions that somebody try to take in the future, they going to, damn. <laughs> Somebody's going to still be able to move forward and somebody could be pissed because they really tried to block somebody from receiving something and they was confident that somebody was going to walk away or be able to get away with something. Until something came to light about an empress trying to sabotage somebody's lover, a mother figure. I feel like the empress is like a mother or um, like somebody that is, uh, they was trying to sabotage something for somebody. Now somebody wishing that they had long-term investments because somebody's partnering up with this queen of cups now. Not Queen of Cups, Queen of Pentacles, somebody that's very uh in the upright, basically. Okay. Very responsible, loving, nurturing, kind. And something changed because somebody held back from taking this leap of faith with a King of Cups. 
And somebody was trying to figure out how the hell did you know that they was trying to have you in poverty or be left out in the cold from a reconciliation? That something backfired and they're pissed off that somebody's telling them, hey, yeah, cycle is over now. Something came to a complete end of somebody being able to take a certain type of action. They like, oh my gosh. Okay, really, oh my fucking gosh. Somebody can't get over you at all. Somebody is scared of you in real life. Your children love you very much. Heart chakra magic is backfiring on somebody. They feel bad for what they did. So they could even did things to your children. Like, uh, whatever. They could have caused some discord in your family unit with your children or something like that. They got to pay for that. Somebody got a Lexus, Bentley, Infinity, Mercedes, or a Tesla. They are shook right now. Muslim man or a woman. Because everything is backfiring on them in a group. So that could be religion. That's the religion. Oh, Jesus. What's going on? On Sunday, okay, in the fall. Damn, they lost everything for coming for you. And they are stressed out to the max. That heart chakra magic is backfiring on them. They low-key jealous of you. You was the one they about to lose you for good. This person is scared of you. The person is scared of you in real life. They was doing a lot of beauty spells because they're jealous of you. They could have been trying to steal your beauty. Okay. Jeez. That's my own. Unfinished business in love with an air sign. Somebody knows that. They see you move past all the obstacles that they put up for you. It could be a Nigerian man or a woman. They lost everything for coming for you. Somebody that's very religious. Religious belief systems. They can't stop missing you. Okay. What is this? Unfinished business in love with a water sign. Your ex is stalking you on Facebook, Instagram, TikTok, Snap, YouTube, or Twitter. Somebody has mental issues. This person has mental issues. They needed you to help them grow spiritually. Somebody could have been selling sex online. She tried to set him up. Because you are having a new beginning moving forward. They want to know what can they do to get you to trust them again. Root Chakra Magic is backfiring. Gemini. Thursday. They so attracted to you, but you hard to get next to. A karmic woman knows that crown chakra magic is backfiring on them. They didn't mean what they said about you to others. Yeah. Your child's mother fails you and they sorry. Somebody see you going through a body transformation, getting fit. Aries, all evil eyes are going blind. Virgo, M. Somebody know you getting some money coming in here. A old love. Somebody got dreads or braids. Somebody could be a pastor or a priest. They know a soulmate is coming in and your destiny is safe. Because, yeah, wow, you mean everything to me. Unfinished business in love with a fire sign. We got Libra. Somebody want to be with you bad. Okay. Wow. It could be another Libra. They about to ghost you. And first layer's middle initial. Yours are here. They tried to catfish you, but you knew it was them. Return to sender times 10. All blockages are removed. They cannot rob you. Somebody want to know what's your new number? Somebody was riding past your house in the daytime or at night. They know that this spiritual warfare is over. He was mad because you walked away from him and he wanted revenge. That's why something was happening. The hell? But the police is watching this person? A Sagittarius. She walked away from a karmic. This postal worker could be getting fired because they stole your mail. You will be getting a pay raise.
We got a grand pop. They know you are connected to the all that is and all that will ever be. That's how you found something out. We got a Scorpio Q. Son or daughter. Something about somebody's son or daughter. Balance and harmony is being restored in every area of your life. And he is so mad. A Capricorn. Everybody knew this person was pressed about you. Because they are narcissists. Fake friends. So this is a narcissist fake friend in the springtime. That was pressed about you. A Leo. They are bisexual or on a DL. Oh, why does that keep coming out like that? Maybe this is somebody that watches, you know, it's like that. We got an Earth Angel. It was a suicide mission. They've been caught. A Pisces. They used to stalk you at the gym. I heard used to. They wasn't being honest with you, so that's why you get to move on. Somebody wish your new number only wanted your number so that they can tape a conversation, but it backfired on them. Something, it was not, you know, they couldn't blackmail you. So this weekend, you made the right choice. They still in love with you, but they can't hide it no more. Big dick energy. You, they know you protected from all evil. Your child's father failed you and they sorry. Uh, if you're reading this, it's too late. What else? Mind games is backfiring on somebody's mother. Child. Unfinished business in love with an earth sign. Open your heart to new love. Somebody drive a truck of any kind. Hybrid, Jeep, Ford, Chevrolet, Ram, Dodge. GMC, whatever kind of truck they got it. They created a mess and they was looking for somebody to help them fix it. Somebody got a silver, gold, white, gray, or yellow car. Aquarius. They did graveyard magic and it's backfiring on them, G. Oh. He was walking away from a karmic. And return to sender to all involved, known and unknown, on Friday. It's not your fault that they suffering from karma. Somebody that got short, a woman with shortcut. She could have a shortcut, deep waves, curly hair, or whatever. She's suffering from karma now. Saturday. Because what they did on Tuesday, they tried to track you GPS style. And they all in their head and their feelings. A neighbor that had unhealthy uh, addiction to you or something like that. They were very obsessed with you. Because you be looking good in your pictures. What the hell? This weekend. Stalk alert. Somebody don't want to fight. They want you to unblock them. Someone is about to get arrested because they phone is tapped. A white man or a woman. Is his wife or girlfriend that paid for spell work on you? Yeah. L. Sacred Chakra Magic is backfiring. What else? You don't know them. This truck driver that has a green, turquoise, tan, brown, gold, or burgundy car. They wanted to bring a spend the night bag. Somebody saw it as hell. Somebody with a black, red, orange, purple, or blue card. Because they asked their fake friend to watch you and they fell in love with you. Like, yeah. So leaving them behind was the best thing. Your destiny. I'm sorry, you were destined for greatness. You're a king or a queen. Somebody could be a CNA. Uh, RN or a doctor, somebody that's a Chinese man or a woman in the summertime, five years ago. Something that happened last weekend. It was a part of something that happened last weekend with an X, Z. Leaving them behind was the best thing for everybody involved. And she was mad that somebody walked away from them. So she wanted revenge. So whatever is happening is like karma is playing out basically for all involved in the situation where 
yeah. I hope this helped.